Okay, so just pulled up here in Montana. We've been driving. I've been driving since yesterday morning from about nine o'clock yesterday morning till midnight last night. And to this morning at five and then till now it's about three o'clock. <coughs> just got to Montana, got everything loaded up. We got the peeps. Let's see the frat house. Frat. You guys look like a frat house is what you look like. You smell like a frat house. <laughs> How's those bathrooms? Uh, they're still airing out. Not good. Not good. So anyway, this is the crew right here. Strand, you know that guy. Hey there. We got Brian, Casey, back there. Introduce yourself to the people. I'm Darren. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Tactical Darren. Tactical, Tactical Darren. Darren. So anyway, so we're trying to get things established here real quick and go out and zero some guns. Yeah, oh my got, goodness. Some doe tags. Whew. It still smells in there. I know why you guys are out on the porch. <laughs> so exactly. let's go. We're going to go pick up some doe tags. What's on the agenda here? Doe tags, liquor store, food. <laughs> we're not even going to probably hunt. Sounds, sounds like a good night. Yeah. Exactly. So we're going to get on the road. Um, anyway, gonna, it's going to be cold. It's going to be We're fun. We're expecting a lot of snow. A lot of snow. Lot of it's, snow. Uh, there's some weather coming in, so here we go. Okay, so we came out here to the nearest public land, but you can't see. Uh, over there, that's private, but like in here, you can't see hardly at all. So we were just going to zero our rifles, but we'll just try to do it tomorrow. It's starting to fall again, starting to snow a little bit. It is freezing cold, and uh, so we're going to go get... Back to the house, got to go organize some stuff. And um, anyway, we will be out bright and early tomorrow morning, ready to harvest some deer. Hopefully, if it's supposed to blizzard tonight. So we'll see what happens. But anyway, yeah, I just, I just, we just don't feel comfortable shooting into this fog when you don't know. Yeah, you just, yeah, it's so flat and I don't know, it just doesn't feel right. So we're going to botch that idea right now and go get some sleep tonight we only got about four hours last night so get some sleep and then hit hunting hard tomorrow so guys get ready for tomorrow we have 14 tags yeah 14. we have yeah we have six buck tags and eight doe tags <laughs> goodness gracious uh montana is the land of opportunity if you, if you do ask me but <clears throat> say something incredible um <laughs> and now you know that now you know that <laughs> So I'm going to give you a brief overview. This is where cold out there. This is where I stayed last night. The canvas cutter on the ground. It's kind of rolled up now. Dirk slept right here. Okay. We had we had bodies everywhere. Gonna restock the good call. We've got. Uh, Gear all over the map. I'm not real sure who resided in there. Casey, I think. Shoot that machine. Darren has agreed to shoot the first buck he sees. That is not That's exciting. That is true. That well, is he was absolutely. going to shoot the first buck, so we drove into town. That is true. Okay, well, the first buck we happen to see happened to be a very large buck. Grab the old girl. Oh, yeah. Gonna be a cold. Truck bound morning is what it looks like. Much shield to where they can actually see. You see any deer? <laughs> After we do it. What are we doing? <laughs> what are we doing? What are we doing? <laughs> we only got 30 miles on this road to go. We're not even out of town yet. We're not even out of town yet. We saw deer back there. White tails. You about ready to find a breakfast place? <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> you see like, the cows? I already had breakfast. The I'm cows are sure. just standing there like. I hate a, myself. This is awful. <laughs> I got five more months of this. <laughs> What's the story here, Derek? So, we've been trying to make the best out of a <clears throat> bad situation, if you will. It's visibility is about 150 yards. The wind's about, what do you say, 30, 40 miles an hour? 30, yeah. And uh, pretty sure all the deer are hunkered down because, um, yeah, the wind's too, blowing too much, all this snow. We've driven by a bunch of cattle and you can just see those things like they're hunkered down in these little coolies and just waiting to freeze to death. They're all grouped together. <laughs> they look like ghosts. It's kind of weird. I kind of feel bad for them. I do too. <laughs> uh, it, looks, it looks miserable. It looks really miserable. So we just turned around. We're going to head back, back home, you know, and uh, make some breakfast. 
sit around and visit for the day, I think. I kind of wait till the weather changes a little bit and straightens out and clears off. That way, get the deer moving again. Um, I'm pretty sure they're not. We're moving. We haven't seen anything. So, uh, back, back home. Back home. Back to the drawing board. Sure don't want to go for a walk? I was wondering what you were doing Just stir some things up. Let's go. Did deer Let's drive? Go. Yeah, no, we were going to drive that last coolie back there, that last hauler. <laughs> we drove by a couple cows back there and you could barely even see them. Those white cows were like, I hate my life right now. <laughs> yeah, let's get back. Back to the house. Let's go back to the house. This, I mean, when it lets up, it's going to be go time. Absolutely. Yeah, but right now, 75 yard visibility, not awesome. It's going to be blowing a steady 30. It's blowing good. Yeah. Just being out there for five minutes, I don't know if I'd want to take care of a doe right now. I just no. don't know if I would. We were saying the same thing. <laughs> I'll meet you at the house. Okay. Got back to the house here. It's just been blizzarding all day long. I don't know if you can see it behind me. Visibility's not very good. So we're just, we're just sitting it out. And uh, so today's pretty exciting. It's Sunday. Today is the launch day of Land of the Free. So everybody's all excited for it i'm excited for it check this out look at this we have the meats. That is a lot of meat. It's like Arby's. Yeah, the cool thing the is, like, after you're done, you can just take what's left over and put it in the breakfast breeder tomorrow morning. Perfect. Or a taco. Or a taco. Or, or put it on a hot dog bun. Or, or anything. Or anything. Yeah. It's going to be good. Tomorrow is the day, though. We're super excited for tomorrow. Dirt, give me a percentage of something that might die tomorrow. 99.999%. Uh, and I'll bet on that. I'll bet on that horse every time. Every day. And all day. <laughs> Twice on Sunday. Yeah. Yeah. Every time. <laughs> We've actually officially been snowed in today. Oh man. It was and tomorrow. I think today would have just been a waste of fuel, honestly. It was dude, there was you could only see like hundred yards. Yeah. And there was nothing moving. Nothing moving. But it's supposed to let up tonight. Well, tomorrow morning early. It's supposed to let up. And it's gonna be go time. Tomorrow's gonna be good. Really? Nobody's ever done this. No, never, never gone live. Oh, no, I thought I was talking about the live. Oh, all right. So, never done that either, though. We ready? Strand, we ready? Rock and roll. Rock and roll. All right. So, we have haystacks, guys. This is what I grew up on. This is kind of a family favorite. Uh, I have Juanitas, any chips, usually just regular chips, but these are, we love Juanitas, bottom line. We love them. And so, you throw those on the plate, smash them up. Take the elk burger, give it a dip, good smattering, don't deny it, supply that. Cheese, cheese is going to melt on the elk burger because it's so hot, okay? And don't, you know, don't skimp that. Lettuce, any condiment really. And then diced up these onions with a dollar knife. Smatter that over the top, throw maybe just a little salsa on there. That might have been a little much. <laughs> Tapatio. Don't stop till it's too much. Might have got a little hot. And then ranch. And right there, I mean, you can... Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> That's hey, pretty good eating. Haystack. Eight, six, Whew, good morning. You guys ready for this? Today is the first day of the rest of your life. Write that down. So today is pretty much opening day. Um, yesterday we just we were stuck in the house watching brand new Land of the Free. It turned out awesome. Anyway, it was cool. It was a lot of fun. And today is going to be our opening day. So we're excited. It's not snowing out right now. It's uh, I think it's. 18 degrees, I think, something like that. Right now, someone said, so yeah, we are ready to rock and roll. Probably go back again. Well, 
we are on the move. It's about eight o'clock and uh, we're driving to one of the BMAs we have permission to hunt on and drove by a type one BMA. And type ones, if you're not familiar with Montana, um, they're like a written permission only, but you can get permission out of sign in blocks. So we uh, spotted a pretty nice uh, whitetail buck, which we weren't really expecting to see. And uh, now we're gonna try and make a move on them. There's some up left there. What do you think, they're just stone? I'm thinking we're trying to get stuck here real quick. Yeah, we're also trying not to get stuck because the roads are... We're plowing snow right now. Jacked up. Sun's popping out and these deer are just starting to come out of the brush, but we got a couple spots down here in about, I don't know, eight, nine miles that we're gonna try and get to. And hopefully these deer are doing the same thing on these other pieces that we can hunt. So try not to do the next update from the truck. So far we've spent a lot of time in the truck covering ground. A phone can't get up. a hard time. <laughs> That Chevy sank in the snow like a rock. Sure did. <laughs> Big boy twice. Okay. That Chevy sank like a rock. Sank like a rock. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. There's some big, big giant drifts in a lot of these places. Yeah, these it's just going to be just. They're deep. We were, uh, we were jacked about nobody being here, and now it's like, well, I wish somebody would have been here first. Yeah, there's, a reason, there's a reason why no one's here. There's a reason, yeah. But we do have one big white tail that if we want to go after, we can go after him. So we've got options ish. What's uh, can we drive back on that road that you went down back there? No, That's nothing there. Just goes to the house. Just goes to the house. Okay, so over this ridge right behind me here, we drove past where the deer are. Over this ridge, hopefully, we can get a good vantage point here. Oh, the sun feels nice. Are you gonna take that phone scope? Okay. I'll get the, I'll take this camera, you take phone scope. Two feet in the room. Three seventy. Let me know. You guys ready? Yeah. Dirk? Yeah. Oh my god. You got to go ahead, green light. Shot. Oh, one shot. Down? I got him out. He's done. He's down. I dropped down just a little bit on my adjustment. Okay, Good job. <laughs> Good job. Good job Dude, that was awesome. Oh, I'll take that hunt. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Oh. <laughs> that was like, got him. Got it. Click that barrel out. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. One down. <laughs>
I can't wait to see him. I haven't got a good look at him that yet. Other, that other buck, uh -huh. the little buck came up, he's all bristled up. Like he pinned his ears back and was just walking up him? the hill. Yeah. When that awesome. buck came running he's down, he's up there, he's up there looking at him. Nice job. <laughs> awesome, Harold. Dude, awesome. I can't wait to go see him. <laughs> Cannot wait. <laughs> What's cool is everyone's here too. Yeah, dude. Yeah, that was that was the How best part. Do that? Not very. <laughs> yeah, right? dude, dude, not very. The lineup of spotting scopes was. Legit. Well, the problem was when he shot, nobody said a word. It was like we we should we could have we could have handled that a little better. Yeah. Claim the prize. First tag done. Man. Cannot wait to see First him. Tag One down, thirteen to go. Oop! Watcher back there, Dirk. Oh, easy. easy. Ooh. <laughs> Hope you got knives, packs, and game bags. Hope your deer doesn't run away. <laughs> How about snacks? Snacks. Who brought the orange slices? <laughs> the orange. Yeah, dude, if you want to shoot Darren. Darren, no, I could double it up. Double dog Darren. He's pretty heavy. He's weird. He's a good buck. Four by three. Four by four. Yeah. It's a little four by four. He says, get out. They are rutted up. It's a big deer. Like his body. Yeah. Eye guards, too, huh? Yeah. He's got pretty thick. He's got some mass on him. Let's go recover out that our, buck. Out of our lives forever. Yeah, it is. It's a great buck. That's awesome. That's a great buck. They are definitely uh, man, look how rutted up right now. He is so pretty. Look at his face. See what I mean by body size? Yeah, they're big. They're a lot bigger. Dude, I'm pumped. Dude, good That's job. Awesome. Right on. Get him out. Back to the uh, nice back of the truck. <laughs> nice job, bud. That's great. They are big. Yeah, felt like it looked pretty. I think it felt so we're just gonna take care of him here. Get the uh, get the guts out of him. We're gonna drag him back to the trucks, and we've got some time left this evening. We can find some more. I believe we can. Congratulations, bud. Good job. Good shooting. Good work. Knife. So we're gonna get out of here, head to get the buck back to the pickup, and keep hunting more. That's the cool thing about here. We got a ton of tags, and um, anyway, we only got six days or so. So we're just gonna make the most of it and try to double up, maybe even triple up today. You never know. So good times with good people. That's what it's about. Okay, we uh, found another buck. Went down the road about, I don't know, a mile and a half or so. One that Darren wants to take a better look at here. But they were kind of edgy. And so I hope they're not gone. But we'll see what happens here. Can you see the bugs? There's one bug down there. Just yeah, to the left I see that. Patchy bottom. He's still in the bug. Dirk's going to get the spotter on him. That big one that we saw. He, he, I think he went around the corner to the left there. Hmm. Yeah, he's not a bad buck. How far is that? Like 500, right up to 500 mark. Well, I think if we, I was thinking if we hustle over and get on back on, 
on that other knob and look up that draw. I think we go up this one and we can maybe cut off to the right. Try it. Maybe we can see back in there enough where that other one's at. Okay. Might get lucky. We're cutting the distance by a couple hundred yards. Probably. Hopefully we can find that. Find that other box. Hit, sounded. Yeah. You're kind of to the right here, a little bit to the right. Got him again. I see him drifting right a little bit. I might just be putting too much wind on him. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I have both times Oh, yeah. You got him both times. Yeah, go ahead right now. There's, you want through the timber. Go through the timber, maybe. There's a deer walking through the timber. Get on him, get on him, get on him, get on him. He's falling. He's going, he's getting ready to go down. He's down, he's down. You down? Down. Big D. <laughs> <laughs> oh. How's that? Good shooting. <laughs> he would have made a better shot. Good job, brother. I think he had a better wind break than I thought he did. Yeah. So I had him paid for an eight mile an hour wind. Too much, too much right wind on him. Yeah, it looked like it was a little bit far back, but. Where'd you, you feel? Where'd you feel the second shot? He was moving, so I put it basically right on his shoulder, so he would kind of step into it and then yeah. I went. So. <laughs> He's uh, a big deer, dude. That's a that's a damn. He's a four. That's yeah. the best deer we've point? seen. That's yeah. the best deer we've seen. Here's the four before. One side's got nice forks. The other one's got a little bit. I saw the one. I saw the one side. He's a mature buck for sure. Good job, bud. It's a good deal. <laughs> nice buck. What do you think? You pleased with him? He's not. He might not be super tall, but he's heavy. Yeah. yeah. He's got a nice mass. Yeah. Is that a little five on the one side? Yeah, a little kicker. <sighs> yes. a, little, a little sticker. Oh, that's, heck yeah. That's a good deer, buddy. That's a beauty. Congratulations, bro. Thank you. Appreciate it, guys. Dude, it's been so awesome getting to meet you and then getting to actually spend some time hunting. It's been nothing, nothing better. Nothing short of awesome. Awesome. Yeah. We're, just, we're just getting started. Oh, yeah. It's awesome. Thanks, fellas. We're going to get him uh, dragged down to the bottom here and we're going to take care of him and get back to hunting. Yeah, 2020 Montana. So far, ain't bad. No. Yeah, more to come. More to come. Guys, what, what you how about there, him, boys? fellas? How we doing, boys? <laughs> what do we got? Nice. Got you, Darren? Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Dude, nice job, man. That's awesome. <laughs> what, five by four? Oh, nice. With guards? Oh, I call them a four by four. We got a little sticker on there. Dude, Casey right just on, passed man. a three by four. We saw, dude, there's three Person bucks. Goes. Good one. Nice shot. Yeah. Yeah, there's, there's three bucks together. There was a good one with and him, I, too. And I saw, there was the first one, I'm like, ah, oh, he's a nice yeah. buck, I don't know if he's worth going for, and then like two more came up, I'm like, oh, dude, that one in the back. And then I'm kind of lost track of him. I heard that action go, 
<laughs> yes. <laughs> well, we, lost, we lost track of two of them. We could see one, and I was like, and we, we kind of dipped down and went strides, and we still see him. I was like, well, I don't know if he's good enough to shoot. Let's let's see if we can spot those other two bigger ones. Yeah. Let's kind of go up to one and drop down another one and went up. And we came up here. We see him, and I was like, ooh, dude, that's a shooter. <laughs> he's thick. Nice. He's thick. Heck yeah, that's, that's cool. a great look. And so, uh, 218 yards with a 15 mile an hour wind. Nice. And then the other one that, that wasn't there one more. That was yeah, the. There was yeah. one more. Yeah. And he was heavy, and it, it looked like a great buck. We didn't get a real good look at him though. No. Definitely heavier deer out here though, huh? Yeah. 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 I think so. Yeah. I think we just do a little bit of search, and we'll find some. Yeah, you guys are ready to rotate for some warm hands. Find some what? humdingers. Yeah. I just want to know, like, as far as taxidermist wise, what do you want? Oh yeah. Oh, that one. I can't save that cape. That one's good. What about that guy? What are you gonna do with him? I don't know. Yeah. We're trying to tell them to mount it. Mount it. Mount it. All right, day one's in the books. Day one's in the books.